Mateusz Wolski is a musician and a bridge builder, creating connections between things like music, racing, science, and more. He plays first violin and is the concertmaster for the Spokane Symphony. As concertmaster, Mateusz forms a bridge between the conductor and musicians. Because on one hand, you are trying to really advocate for your colleagues, especially when the conductors ask for something that is not necessarily comfortable. So in that moment, it's like, you know, I'm the guy that is going to have to tell and push back and say, hey, can we, can we play just a little slower? Because I think you're going to get exactly the same results as you're looking for, but we'll be able to play all the notes on the page as opposed to just hang on for our dear life. Uh, on the other hand, sometimes a conductor comes with the crazy idea uh, that makes it very awkward and hard to play but I can definitely see why they're doing it and then my job is to convince or reinforce the conductor's vision and say guys we really have to try it let's at least give it a shot so you know so I have to keep sort of switching signs um, therefore I'm stuck between the rock and the hard place fortunately Mateusz is well suited for the job I was a kid that was pretty rambunctious, singing, dancing, banging on the piano when I was little. He grew up in Warsaw, Poland, behind the Iron Curtain, where he began his musical training at the age of seven. He was accepted into music school and assigned an instrument, the violin. Which was very devastating because we had a piano at home and I thought that I'm going to be playing piano. Um, today, I'm very happy that that didn't happen and that led me to discovering playing music with other people rather than by yourself. It's, it's, it's a fantastic way of making friends and having a good time. Mateusz attended the Chopin Music Academy in Warsaw and then traveled to the U.S. to the Manhattan School of Music where he made friends with the future Spokane Symphony music director Eckhart Proy. Eckhart called me when he was looking for a concertmaster here many, many years later and asked me to, uh, to essentially come and audition for the orchestra, which I did, and, and here we are today. <laughs> One, two, three, four. After Eckhart hired Mateusz, they began thinking about trying new things, and Mateusz was put in charge of running his own concert series. We'll give you a small chamber orchestra, and you can program whatever you want. And I really heard the part that, that he said, you know, program whatever you want. So, Mateusz began bridging the worlds of classical music and late night comedy by establishing The M Show, a series of live performances in Spokane, where M stands for music, mayhem, and mystery. We burned the violin and viola, we, we dipped some percussion instruments in the liquid nitrogen, we did all sorts of things for science, obviously. I want a person from the street coming in to the M show, not knowing anything about music or classical music particularly, and simply by having a good time, a few laughs, and learning a little, a little bit about what the instruments are like, what the musicians are like, that people shouldn't have inhibitions about coming to a classical music concert and not knowing how to dress and when to clap. It, it, I mean, this is all irrelevant. Another left turn for Mateusz has been to enter the world of autocross. In autocross, one car runs the track at a time, taking gut-wrenching hairpin turns. You know, you go 65, maybe 70 miles an hour for a split of a second, but that's about it. It's all about precision driving. Leave it to Mateusz to find connections between racing and music. Once you start racing, you cannot stop. Just as once you walk on this stage and start playing your concerto, you cannot stop and say, hold on a second, I can do it better. No, you just, you just have to go with it. That zone, when you challenge yourself for the ultimate edge of, of your performance, that's the most dangerous and the most exciting part of life as a musician and as well as the life of a racer. Mateusz fills his days with teaching, rehearsing, and performing. His most fulfilling connection is right. with family. Oh yeah, look at that.
His wife Dawn is a world-renowned opera singer and general director of Inland Northwest Opera. Together, these two active professional musicians are raising their son, Stefan. Um, it's wonderful because you can talk about things that a lot of civilians, so to speak, would, would don't know how to deal with. Honey, I have to practice right now or leave me alone, I have to focus. You know, and never mind if there's a sink full of dishes. Now you add a child into the mix and childcare and busy schedule and you realize that your life before that was so much easier. You know, and I know today I would never ever change a thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm very fortunate to, to have that kind of life and that kind of family.